All right, welcome back everybody. GoPro Tabers here with GPT Adventure Channel. And I uh, got a product review over definitely one of my most favorite lures to use <clears throat> for all types of fishing. For trout fishing, panfish, for bass, saltwater, you name it. This freaking lure right here will catch everything. And even some stuff that you don't want to catch, like a carp or like a little sucker fish. It'll catch it all. And uh, this is one of those products I can't say enough about. So without any further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get into the product and show you some that I have been using and some that are brand new. So as you can see, this one, it's been through the ringer. The tail's almost gone. It looks weathered. This is the half ounce one. This is a big daddy. This is one I like to use for like ladyfish in the surf or pompano or anything like that and uh, salt water use. And it's still made with great materials, high quality grade. Uh, you can see it hadn't been chewed up too bad. So I um, had this one about a year, and luckily enough, I've been able to keep it on, all, all together for one and two, catch a ton of fish with it. So uh, these two different sizes down here, and uh, this one is, I think it's uh, right around, I want to say it's like a quarter ounce, excuse me, um, three-eighths of an ounce. This one's one-sixth. These are one-sixteenth. So these are the little guys. I like to use these for trout very specifically simply because it looks like a little rainbow trout one two it looks like a small bait fish that we found in a small trout stream and uh <clears throat> this one over here doesn't necessarily have to be for trout you can use this for any bluegill or sucker fish or just about anything will bite this lure just because it looks like your standard bait fish silver spinning blade white body a little bit of gray tint into the uh the body there and then it's got very, very sharp treble hook with the, the little feathers. So little feathers, when they get wet, they all clump together. Down by the hook helps mask the hook. And it acts like a little uh, little tail fin there for the fish. So awesome, awesome, awesome lures. I like to use, personally, the original. You can see all of these down here are the original style. They do come in different variants, though. Like this one, it's just got your uh, engraved blade. It says rooster tail and tells you the size and everything on the blade right there. So... Uh, very cool how they do that, make it look like scales of a fish, so when it's spinning around and the fish catches a glimpse, he'll think it's another little bait fish. But this orange one right here in particular, this one right here, it's been through the ringer. I, I caught a fish on it, it bent this top portion right here when I was trying to de-hook it, which is not a big deal, simply because I can literally take this, and since it's just a steel wire, I can just bend it backwards and straighten that right out. So um, this one has a similar effect with the engravings. However, it's got like a shimmer to it or a shine on that blade, which adds a little bit extra effect in mon like dirty or dingy water. Uh, orange is a pretty cool color to use because you can usually see, you know, if it's up close, see the fish right when it hits it because you can follow your lure through that stained water. So another awesome color combination uh, for the uh, rooster tail here. So like I said before, this is one of my personal favorite lures, lure types, and uh, I recommend you find out more information about the product at the link below in the description, and uh, definitely go get you some of these. They are awesome. They are not expensive. You can usually pick them up between two and three bucks, maybe three fifty for some of the large ones or four bucks, and uh, have a blast. They last a long time. You're not going to wear them out like some of the other lower quality brands, but uh Overall, it's definitely something that's been around for a while, and it will continue to be around for a while because of one thing, they catch fish. So, guys, I hope you pick some up. Go try them out. Please comment in the bottom. Let me know what type of fish you're catching. And uh, if you have a link for one of those videos, put it in the comments box. I'll approve it. I don't care. So, hope you guys found this useful. Go pick you up some today. Thanks.